Let's get this started up first. We have an undercard fight schedule five jokes tit for tat. Introducing first, he looks like he complains to strangers about trans women in sports. Matt Summerstein! <laughs> Good. I uh, had to stop complaining about trans women in sports to make an yeah. answer. I'm happy to be here. I'm happy to be here. Thanks for having me. Very happy to have you. We're going to be your opponent. He thought the last year was about you. He'll know this one's about him. <laughs> Guys, give it up for Moo Dang's mother, Daniel Brewer! How you doing tonight, Daniel? Good. Happy to be your mother. <laughs> <laughs> you ready for this fight? Yeah, I'm very excited. All right. Five jokes, tip for tat. Matt, Daniel, which one of you would like to go first? Uh, I'll go first. Daniel's going first. Matt's going second. Fight Club, what do you guys say? Are you ready for this fight? <laughs> Five jokes starting with Daniel. This fight starts now. Yeah, Daniel, we can on any big beat. Yeah, this, uh, this looks like a battle between two guys trying to get out of their friend zone, right? <laughs> Matt looks like someone you'd meet and you find out they were a ghost the whole time. <laughs> First one. That's it, okay. Uh, Daniel was molested as a kid. Which raises the question, were there no other kids? <laughs> of course, that was a horrible experience. But a win for the body positivity movement. <laughs> Matt, you mole elf that gets fired for getting an erection. <laughs> Matt identifies as asexual predator. And <laughs> <laughs> okay. uh, Daniel has a girlfriend. I know, right? <laughs> She's Jewish, and they recently took a trip to Israel, which raises the question, which is a bigger war crime, bombing civilians or having sex with Daniel? <laughs> Matt looks like he uses a Ouija board to call the cops on black ghosts. <laughs> ghosts, 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 ghosts. <laughs> Matt and I have a lot in common. We both had dads that abandoned us, except mine left to start another family, and his left because he died. <laughs> Matt's dad died when he was two, but don't worry, his hairline joined him shortly after. <laughs> Very bald. Uh, Daniel's pair. Oh, the fuck. Oh, Daniel has attempted. Uh, no, no, hold on. Sorry, sorry, sorry. It's about to say Daniel's attempt. Today, Julia. Way to have it. Uh, Daniel and his girlfriend live together. She makes more money than him. She's the primary breadwinner. He's the primary bread eater. <laughs> she brings home the bacon, he shoves it up his ass. <laughs> you can say he's a sugar baby, that's just pre diabetes. <laughs> Damn, boy, he's thick! Give it up for my opponent, ghost of a guy that died here 20 years ago. <laughs> uh, God, Matt has the face of someone who knows what time his ex wakes up. Combo <laughs> breaker! <laughs> Matt's, uh, Matt's ex has a horse face. I'm sorry, I mean she has a horse face. <laughs> uh, Daniel is born and raised in Queens. His parents are actually cousins. His father is Bartolo Colon, and his mother is... <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. And his mother is Grimace. Uh, would John explain why he grew up to look like Ness from Super Smash Bros if he was raised in a dumpster behind Taco Bell? <laughs> Matt looks like Uncle Fester if Uncle Fester tried to Ozempic and then gave him halfway and just did cocaine. <laughs> Last show. Uh, Daniel and his brother were mo both molested by the same guy. It's easier to molest two pair of fans than it is to pick one up. <laughs> no, seriously. No. That was fine. Okay, yeah. Fight Club! Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I thought I recognized you. You're the Western Wall. <laughs> Very fun battle. We'll go to our judges. Starting with you guys, Fight Club. Do you think the winner of this fight is Matt Summerstein? Yeah. <laughs> or is the winner of this fight Daniel J. Parafan? <laughs> One more choice. I feel like they just don't like either of you personally. <laughs> Funny. I think it's just a 
something about you. <laughs> Dave Cyrus will go to you when you think. I mean, I think that was a really good battle for how much you people seem to despise these guys. <laughs> that was like the amount of applause you give when it's two people's first time and nobody laughed. So, uh, first of all, Ben, uh, thank you for reminding me to watch The Penguin tonight. Uh, it's a good show. It is. It is. Uh, this was a great battle between a Jewish guy and a literal matzo ball. <laughs> No, and by the way, Dan, you know that I'm a, a huge fan of yours. I love you. You know, I, I always feel for you. You know, I, you know, Dan was going through a lot. He was recently kind of falling apart, and all the king's horses and all the king's. <laughs> <laughs> um, it, this was like, this was both of you guys. This was great. This was a really yeah, good. Yeah, you guys awesome. both had one. Oh, you guys both had one joke that was like top level joke that anyone like ever gets off of. So I. I hate, I, I, I think I'm gonna give it to, uh, to, uh, uh Bold Jew. Woo! Yeah. It's close. All right, there's one vote for Bold Jew. <laughs> Katie Reynolds. All right, I mean, look, I always love a little battle of the betas, okay? <laughs> really, I love that, I love that. I love you guys when you cross streams. Uh, but look, I just, I feel like I agree. Really fucking strong round. And these are my pals too. They're fucking good comics, man. Not to be earnest. And uh, <laughs> look, what I have to do is, I have to vote for Daniel, or else Matt's gonna kill himself. Okay? <laughs> yeah, if he wins this, I think he's gonna die. Okay? <laughs> he doesn't like being mean. All right, so it goes to Daniel for me. Daniel, yeah. yeah. what do you think? Yeah. Great battle through and through. Uh, really inspiring to see that Dan learned to read for this battle. <laughs> <laughs> that was cool. uh, I like that you came from the future to warn Matt about what this is going to look like. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. But no, I like great jokes from the both of you. I do think Matt just like got in more hits. So I give it to Matt. All right. Matt went a little more Daniel, so it's two to two right now. Jesse. Comes down to you to break this tie, what do you think? Oh man, this was a great battle. Uh, battle between guys who get way too close while talking to you, for sure. <laughs> um, and this is very hard because, uh, they, you know, Dan is fat and, and Matt looks bald while wearing a hat. <laughs> and uh, I'm gonna go off who needs it more. And when I'm looking in both your guys' eyes, it's definitely Daniel. <laughs> Amazing opening fight, barely. Guys, give it up for your winner, Daniel. Yeah.